Hi, Josh Jones from Jones Motoring. In these changing times, and we understand it's not always possible to get down and visit us at our site here in Cocker Valley Road, and where we're seeing a massive trend towards online sales, we've decided to do some vehicle condition report and road tests just to help in your buying decision. Now in these videos, we certainly aren't going to be talking about the features and benefits of each individual vehicle. You'll find that on our website, jonesmotoring.co.nz, as well as the opportunity to look at our finance calculator and even submit an online application. The vehicle you'll be looking at today is one of our budget vehicles. These typically are traded in, they have the odd minor bump or bruise, but they have been priced accordingly. Now if you're interested in a further mechanical inspection, please talk to our staff about our $70 mechanical inspection we do up at Mike Teasdale Motors, as well as our 12, 24 and 36 month warranty. The most popular is our 36 month warranty for $590. Thanks very much. Just had this New Zealand New Vitara one owner arrive into the budget section. It's got a few E marks on it as expected and I'll just walk you around it. So the front bump has got your stone chipping, a little light, light chipping to the bonnet, but generally pretty, pretty good on that front. Now it's got your all-terrain tyres, so it's going to be ideal in some harsher terrain. There's some scratch down there and some marks. Mark there. Right rear tyre, the scuff there. We're just putting this in the budget section. We're not too worried about these because it's mechanically very good and it is in the budget section. That's the spare wheel. Now it does have the spare wheel cover, but it just doesn't fit with the all terrain tyre on it. A couple of wee marks there, scuffing there. Left rear tyre, a good buff would bring this up really nicely, and there's some, a couple of dints there. But it is in the budget section and it's not a bad vehicle. Front left tyre. Right, now just for the road it. test. So we've checked, it's got the spare wheel on the back obviously. And uh, tools and jack are there. Now I've checked all the heater system, aircon blows cold. Changes directions. So that all works fine. This one's actually your four wheel drive with your neutral. which uh, So I believe you can tie it behind a camper van. Some people use it for that. Electric windows operate fine. As I said, it's a one owner, it's done 116 Ks and it's due for a service just now, so we'll send it up to get it serviced. Two keys. Um, now the tyres are very aggressive, so they are quite noisy, but that'll suit some, some applications, just depending on what you want to use it for. We're just going to leave it on it. Clutch is good. If someone wanted to put it back to road tyres, they could. And I think this vehicle actually did come with a couple of tyres on the back of it. So you could bang another couple in and turn it back to road tyres if you wanted. And it does have the spare wheel cover, but it just will not fit on. I think I might have mentioned that. No clicking on turns. We've checked all the four wheel drive, it works, works fine. But just a good New Zealand new low mileage Tar. It has been used as you can see, so it's got it's got a few marks around it, but honestly a metre away it's a good tidy, you know, honest vehicle. We know it's been well serviced by its, by its one, one and only owner, which take it down the hill. Drive like really nice through all the gears. Just give it a bit of a rev at the bottom. Clean as out the back. So yeah, perfect. And you know, you could put it on your farm, especially when you look at the price of a quad bike.